Today we're doing an upgrade Italian cameraman build challenge, but I'm gonna be secretly using hacks to troll my friend. Using the command slash slash paste, I can instantly spawn on this massive upgrade Italian cameraman build. And little does my friend know, I'm gonna be filling up the entire build with a whole bunch of traps to prank him. But now let's go check out my friend GE. And GE, what in the what are you doing? 901, 902, 903, and are you serious right now, Bubbles? You're literally interrupting my lift right now. This must be fake. There's no way you can lift an airplane. <sighs> <laughs> Bubbles, I need some help. This is literally way too heavy. Don't worry, G. I'll help you. I'll help you. Ah! Ah! Bubbles, what in the world are we doing today? We're going to be doing an upgraded Titan cameraman build challenge. Wait, upgraded Titan cameraman like this camera? Uh, G. E., what are you talking about? I'm talking about the one from Skibbity Toilet. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. But wait a second. What side are you going to go on? The green side or the blue side? Uh, what do you mean? I'm going to go on the green side because it's my favorite. Wait, the green side? That's my side. Oh! oh! Okay, fine, G. Okay, okay, I'll go on the blue side. It's the better color anyway. All right, good. And we only have 10 minutes to build this, so let's get started. 10 minutes, go, go, go! Now that G can't hear me anymore, I could just type in the command. And oh my god, our upgraded Titan cameraman just spawned in. Just like that, and we're way ahead of GE, but I got no time to waste because I gotta put in some traps. And for my first trap, I'm gonna make a sneaky little fake entrance. Where should I put it? Hmm. <gasps> I know, let's put it right inside of cameraman's super cool hammer. So let me just break out a few blocks just like this, and we'll replace them with some emerald blocks and secret doors disguised as emerald blocks as well. Emeralds are GE's favorite blocks, so hopefully this is enough to lure him into our trap. For the fake entrance though, I'm gonna be making GE cross a super dangerous pool of lava only on a thin tightrope. And on top of that, the treasure at the end will be completely fake. Let's go ahead and build out the room first, and then we'll make a huge pool of super hot lava. For the tightrope, I'm gonna be making it out of iron bars because they're super thin and easy to fall off of. We'll make it have some twists and turns, and just like that, the first part of our trap is completed. Like I said earlier, instead of giving him a prize for crossing, we're just gonna put down some trap chests with a command block right underneath. So now when GE goes to collect his prize, it's just gonna spawn in this huge cyclops. What the heck? Ah, it so much damage. Holy moly, I can't wait to see GE get destroyed by the Cyclops. He looks absolutely terrifying. But just like that, and our fake entrance is completed. And before moving on to building the next trap, I'm gonna go check on GE to see how he's doing. I secretly place security cameras on the other side of the competition, so let me just go inside my camera monitor, and look at that, I can see GE building. All right, just a few more blocks, and there we go. My upgraded Titan cameraman looks super good. What do you think of it, Mr. Shulker? What the? Why is GE talking to a Shulker? Has he gone crazy? And wait a second. Why are you attacking me? Oh my nah. How in the world is he gonna build now? But little does bubbles know, I'm gonna place a ton of traps around my entire build with the super secret treasure at the end. And we only have eight minutes left to build this, so this is gonna be perfect. Wait, did he say eight minutes? I gotta get back to my build. Go, go, go. Since we already completed the fake entrance, it's time to put in the real one. And I have just the perfect spot to put it. I think it would be super cool to put the real entrance right inside of cameraman's core. And let's use some ghost blocks as the entrance to make it super duper hidden. You literally can't even tell that anything's there. But now we can go right inside and start building our first official trap. And for this trap, G is gonna have to do some super difficult geometry dash. And if you don't know what that means, I'll show you in just a second. But first, we're gonna have to build out a big platform just like this, and then put down a whole bunch of spikes so it punishes him for falling off. There we go. And now we can place down the springs that G is gonna have to jump over if he wants to make it to the end. These springs might not look dangerous right now, but they certainly will be once I add these spikes onto the ceiling. So let's place them down all the way across the top of the entire course. And just to make sure that the spikes do enough damage, we're gonna replace all of these redstone blocks with a whole bunch of cobwebs. This way, if he hits a spring, he's gonna get stuck in the cobwebs and get absolutely destroyed. <laughs> the only way that he can safely make it across is by jumping over the springs and not get bounced into the spikes. But just like that, and our first official trap is completed. Make sure to stick around to see if GE's actually gonna get through this or get his butt cheeks poked. For the next trap in my build, GE's gonna have to fight a super OP mob boss. First, I gotta build a big enough room. There we go. And then let's place on a big door right over here so it's a surprise when he walks inside. We're also gonna need some super secure iron bars to make sure that the mob boss doesn't escape because this guy is gonna be super duper powerful all right and now that the cage is complete it's time to spawn in the mob boss to help me spawn him in you guys have to hit that like and subscribe button in three two one thank you for subscribing and oh my god this mutant phantom looks absolutely terrifying let's hurry up and cover this up and okay i'm just gonna say it here this boss fight is gonna be the craziest but to make sure that ge can actually put up a good fight let's give him some gear that he can use the only twist is though it's gonna be password protected what's a password he'll never guess hmm let's set it to 5555 five, five, five. there's no way he'll ever guess that and right inside we're just gonna give him a full set of silver armor a silver sword and even a golden apple we'll see if this is strong enough to hold up against this 
phantom. But now that everything's in the chest, we gotta give GE a way to figure out the password. And I have just a perfect idea. Let's go ahead and place a green button and a blue button on the wall. One of them is gonna give him the password and the other one's gonna be a trap. And obviously since blue is the best color in the entire world, it's gonna be the right one. Which leaves stinky green to be the wrong one. Let's go ahead and put a command block right behind the green button. And now if GE decides to press the green button, it's just gonna break the block right under him. He's gonna fall to his death. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully GE falls for this. Now that our trap is successfully set up, let's see if the blue button actually gives us the password. And wait, look at that. It just gave us the password. Which means that our boss fight room is completed. I can't wait to see GE try to fight this thing. Make sure you guys stick around to see it because it's going to be absolutely insane. But for now, let's move on to building the next trap in our build. And honestly, this one might even be cooler than the last. We're going to be building a giant skibbity toilet parkour. Let's build out a gigantic room for it first. And voila. With the room completed, we can start spawning in all of these skibbity toilets. Skibbity dub dub dub. Yes, yes. Oh my skibbity. That is definitely enough skibbity toilets. There's there's no way is gonna survive when he falls down here. Let's start making the parkour with a few easy jumps just like this, and then we'll make some spring jumps all the way to the other side. There we go. Then we'll make him do a slime jump super close to the skibbity toilet. If he's able to make it past, he's gonna have to do some ladder parkour as well. Let's make it go all the way around up just like this, and it'll go straight into a head hitter right over here. Let's do another head hitter leading to a chest right over here. Inside of this chest, we're gonna be giving GE an ender pearl. With the ender pearl, he's gonna have to decide if he wants to teleport to the platform on the left or the platform on the right. And since right is right, then left has to be wrong. So let's replace all of these blocks with ghost blocks. So now when he pearls to the left, he's just gonna fall right through to the skibbity toilets. Hehe, <laughs> I can't wait to see GE fall for that. But there we go. Our skibbity toilet parkour is completed. I have a really cool idea for my next trap as well, but before building it, I wanna go troll GE real quick. And I have just a perfect prank. So let me just fly up to this chest right over here and open it and grab my skibbity toilet spawn egg. And now we gotta figure out where GE is. Let's see. And he's right over there. And whoa, my build's coming out super good. I'm almost finished. What the? He's almost finished. We're gonna do this fast. Let me grab an invisibility potion and go completely invisible. And all right, time to prank him. And nice. Now that this leg's finished, I'm gonna move on to the other one. Okay, now that GE's not looking over here, I can place on this dispenser and we're just gonna put a skibbity toilet spawn egg right inside. And to get him to fall for this trap, we're just gonna put down a sign that says pull to get emeralds. And now all we gotta do is sit over here and wait. Do, 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 do. Just placing a bit more blocks. And wait a second. What the? What is that? I'm totally gonna look at it. Looks like he's saw it. And hold up, wait a minute, pull to get emeralds. I'm totally gonna press it. Let's go. And really, dude, is that a skibbity toilet? Get out of here. Wait, what the? Why was that skibbity toilet so weak? Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna spawn in a whole bunch right behind him. Go, go. Ah! And wait a second, did GE already die to the skibbity toilets? All right, now is my perfect chance while he's busy respawning. I can just go in my inventory and grab this bazooka and then blow up his build. Run, 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 run. And wait, what was that sound? GE's back. And oh my my, nah, what just happened to my build? Oh my goodness, guys. He has no idea it was me. Who did this? Was it you, Skibbity Toilets? Get over here. What the heck? This is super bad. And we only have five minutes left to finish our build. I gotta hurry up. Uh, uh, wait. Did he say five minutes? I gotta get my build done. Go, go. We got him so good with that prank, but we gotta finish our build before the timer runs out. For the next trap in my build, GE's gonna have to pick between two ladders to climb down. One is gonna be deadly and one is gonna be safe. Let's make two areas to go down just like this and then extend it below so we we have some space for the ladders and we'll make it like a tube so GE can't see what's in the room while he's going down. Let me finish the room on the right over here and then place down ladders way down here and I gotta make sure to leave these last two blocks with no ladders so that GE has no way of getting back out. Let's do the same thing on the other side. Yes sir. And just to trick GE we're gonna place signs above each one of these ladders. On top of the one on the right we're just gonna say get your prize and on top of the ladders on the left we're just gonna write get pooped on. GE obviously is not gonna want to get pooped on so most likely he's gonna go down this one which is exactly why we're gonna make get a trap. In this room, we're just gonna place down three super high power sentry turrets. Let's activate them all just like this. And holy moly, look how cool they look. Let's test how powerful they are real quick with a little zombie. And look at that, they're hitting him at rapid fire speed. I can't wait to see GE get destroyed by all of these super cool turrets. As for the other ladder though, it's just gonna be a safe passageway to the next obstacle. Wait a second, I just checked the timer we only have two minutes left. I gotta build this fast. For this next obstacle, GE's gonna have to fly a jetpack. Usually in my jetpack courses, I make rings that look somewhat like this. But this one's gonna be completely different. We're gonna be using these super dangerous lasers instead. To make it past, GE's gonna have to jetpack through a whole series of super dangerous laser rings without dying. And just like that, one of them is completed. And I'm just gonna warn you guys, touching a laser like this is extremely deadly. Look how quick he died. So GE's gonna have to be extra careful when jetpacking through them. Let's make the next ring right over here. Uh-huh. Another one way up here. And one last ring. Yes, sir. All the rings are completed. And now for the final part of the build, 
G is gonna have to decide if he wants the diamond treasure or the emerald treasure. They'll both be placed on the platform just like this. And since it's a universal fact that diamonds are way better than emeralds, the emerald chest will do something very bad. Let's replace it with a trap chest and put a command block underneath. So now when GE goes to collect his emerald treasure, it's gonna spawn in a charged creeper that's gonna blow him up. Oh, and uh, wait, wait a second. Don't look at that. Uh, anyways, now that the trap is set up, we gotta work on the diamond side. The chest on the diamond side is gonna contain the real treasure, which is why we're gonna fill it with a whole bunch of GE's favorite things. Whole lot of emeralds and whole lot of poisonous potatoes. Here we go, and beautiful. Now that's a chest that GE's not gonna complain about. And let's flip and go. Our upgraded Titan cameraman build is completed. And wait, look at that. The timer just went off as well. So now we can go meet up with GE and check out each other's builds. Hey, GE. Hey, Bubbles. Now that we're both done with our builds, whose are we checking out first? Um, really, Bubbles? Is that even a question? All VC mine's way better than yours. What the? That's not even what I was asking. I'm asking whose do we check out first? Are you serious right now, Bubbles? That's super obvious. Obviously, we should check out mine. All right, well, let's see what you got, GE. All right, check it out. And whoa, what the? This is actually pretty good. But, um, GE, where in the world is his hammer? Um, wait, what? His hammer? He doesn't have a hammer, remember? What are you talking about, brother? You must be thinking of Speaker Man. But, GE, how do I even get inside your build? I'll give you a hint, Bubbles. It's your favorite block. My favorite block? So, diamonds. Let me just look around where diamonds are. Nope, that's some blue wool. Come on, come on, come on. And wait, I see some diamond blocks right down there. Good job, Bubbles. You found it. So now let's open this up. And now you're going to have to complete this extremely difficult laser parkour. What the get? Uh, GE, are you sure this is safe? Um, wait, what? Bubbles, it, it was supposed to be safe? I mean, if it's not safe, I don't want to go on it. Wait, 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 wait. But Bubbles, think about it. There could be a trillion diamonds in that chest over there. Wait, what? There was a chest? I didn't even see it. Okay, maybe I get to go on this parkour then. And look at that, GE. I'm literally making it through. Wait, what the? How are you not dying? Because I'm a parkour professional. Oh my gosh. Well, I guess you got kind of lucky there. But now that you made it to the end, you can get your treasure. Yes, finally, a trillion diamonds. GE, you better not be lying. Because I swear, if you're lying, I... what the? Why am I in the void? Ha <laughs> 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 there's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles. You should have saw the look in your face. What the heck, GE? That scared me so much, I started speaking a different language. What, well, since there was no diamonds in there, is this the fake entrance? Yup, and now you're going to have to go around the entire character and find the real one. <laughs> well, is it inside of his camera head over here? No. Nope. Then maybe it's inside of his arm. Let me check. Not even close. GE, where in the world is this entrance? Hmm, the entrance? Am I sure I want to tell you? Please, GE, can you please tell me where it is? Hey, yo, that's really sauce, my boy, but I guess I will tell you, but only under one condition. <gasps> and what condition is that? Everyone watching the video, so like and subscribe right now. Like and subscribe? Quick, guys, I really want to know where this real entrance is, so hit that like and subscribe button in three, two, one. Thank you for subscribing. Holy, they were fast. Now you gotta tell me where the entrance is. Are you serious right now, Bubbles? Fine. I guess I'll show you. Just follow me. All right. And I don't know who you didn't find it, Bubbles, because it's literally right over here. What the? This was so hidden. How am I supposed to figure that out? And, uh, gee, what, where am I? Welcome to the first room, and you're gonna have to choose between this stinky blue door, this beautiful red door, or this luxurious, magnificent emerald door. Well, looking at all of these colors, the blue looks the best. And I mean, it's literally my favorite color. So I'm just gonna go right through. Fine, I guess you chose the right answer. Wait, 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 why am I burning? Ah! Bruh, I should have known you would have made blue the wrong answer. Yeah, but you didn't. And now you have to choose between the red tunnel and the beautiful, magnificent green tunnel. Hmm, well, since you're calling the green one beautiful and magnificent, I feel like you're trying to lure me into a trap. And this red is super cool anyway. It reminds me of Speaker Man. Oh, yeah, that is really true. I guess you figured me out, Bubbles. So go through the red tunnel. Come on, give me some diamonds. And uh, uh, what the? What the? Ow! Haha, <laughs> there's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles. Wait, I'm literally about to die. Just too many silver fish. Oh my god. How did I just pick two of the wrong doors? Uh, I don't know, Bubbles. Maybe because you're a noob. What? I am not the noob. I bet you I'm gonna pick the correct door now. Well, yeah, you have to choose the right door because there's literally one door left. So what, G? It's still gonna be the right one. Let's go. And wait a second. Is this a lava parkour? Yep. And if you miss a single jump, you're gonna get burned by the lava. I guess I just have to be super duper careful. And uh, oh, wait a second, G. Why are there two different sides? I don't know, Bubbles. Maybe you just have to pick one. Well, I'm gonna be completely honest. Those springs look a little bit scary. So I'm just gonna jump on this block right over here. And wait, why did I just fall through? Oh. Haha. <laughs> Brother, were those ghost blocks? Yep. That jump's totally impossible. Oh my god. 
yeah, well, I guess it's good that I know it's the springs now. So let me just bounce over here. Boing, boing. And look at that, G. I'm literally about to make it to the end. Let's go. Good job, Bubbles. You made it across, but you're not ready for what's in this next room. What the? Do you think I'm scared? I'm literally not scared of any. What the heck is that, G? Bubbles, there's literally a mutant stray on the other side of that wall. Are you ready to fight it? It looks super duper terrifying. I'm definitely not ready to fight him. I have nothing. You're definitely ready. I'm going to drop the walls then wait, in wait, three, wait, no, no, two. no, GE. I said I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. Are you serious right now, Bubbles? How in the world could you not be ready? Well, maybe because I literally have nothing in my inventory. Oh my, yeah. I knew you were a new Bubbles, but luckily I prepared for this. I hit a bunch of items around this room and you're going to have to find every single one of them to fight that stray. A bunch of items? Well, I literally don't see anything in here, GE. Uh, yeah, there is, Bubbles. Maybe you just got to look harder. Look, maybe you should put on some glasses. What in the world are those, G? You look like a nerd. Hey, yo, wait, wait, what? I do not look like a nerd, Bubbles. That's, like, really mean. Wait, ignore what you just said, G. Move out the way. I think I see something over here. Come on, let's see if I can reach this chest. And look, I got a personal shrinking device. Good job, Bubbles. You actually found it. And now if you use that device, maybe you can find another item inside of this room. Okay, well, let me just shrink down real quick. And whoa, I look super duper tiny. Wait, what? I don't see a difference. Um, G, if that's your way of calling me short, that is not nice. Haha, <laughs> I'm just kidding. You're super duper tiny now. I can literally step on you. What the? Get away from me. Get over here. <laughs> Get away. I gotta find these items. And wait a second. This pink block looks really suspicious, GE. Wait, why in the world would there be a pink block over there? That's what I'm saying. So I'm just gonna try walking through it. And whoa, it's a little secret tunnel. But hold up. What's inside that chest? It looks like a whole bunch of super cool moth armor and a fairy sword. Wow, GE, I look super cool right now. Yeah, you do look really cool. But wait a second. Why is your sword also pink? Uh, GE, what are you talking about? Well, there's a pink block and a pink sword. Bubbles, are you in love? What the? Hey, hey, stop. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Ha, ha, ha. Bubbles has a crush. Bubbles has a crush. Okay, fine. It might be TV woman. But can we just go on with this fight? Hey, yo, that's really soft, my boy. Okay, I'm gonna drop the walls in 10 seconds. So you better get ready. Bring it on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 3, 1, go. Come over here, mutant stray. And what the? Why is he so fast? He's super duper speedy. Get him, get him. Oh my goodness. Goodness. Wait, he's literally not even doing that much damage to me. I might actually win. Wait, what the what? Are you serious right now? And look at that. I just defeated him. Oh my nah. Are you serious right now, Bubbles? Yep, you're not gonna hate on the pink sword now, are you? I guess not, Bubbles. Let me just open up the next room. And oh, you're not ready for this one. What even is this, GE? Well, look inside that chest, Bubbles, and you'll figure it all out. Okay, well, let me just pick up this weird looking item and place it down. And whoa, what is this? This is a moon moving sofa, and you're gonna have to get past this entire race course to get to the next room. I don't know if you know this about me, GE, but I'm literally the best driver in the entire world. Um, really, Bubbles? We'll see about that. Come on, just gotta take it slow and steady, just like this. And look at that, GE, I'm dodging all the spikes. Whoa, I guess you are pretty good. Yep, and I'm literally almost at the end. Let's go! And, oh, what the? Where did my couch go? Really, dude? You just ran into those spikes. Oh, no, I was literally almost at the end. Can you please just let me pass, GE? Fine, Bubbles, I guess I'll let you pass if I wasn't stupid. <laughs> oh, what the grimace was that for, GE? Sorry, Bubbles, I couldn't let you pass because you did fail after all. So let me just give you a new couch just like this. And I guess I'll go through the whole entire thing all over again. But this time, I'm gonna speed run it. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And I just made it through. Good job, Bubbles, you made it. And now you're gonna have to choose which water is the right one. Which water is the right one? Well, that one over there looks like some wool. And I can't tell which one's real between the these two. So I'm just gonna test my luck and jump down on this one. Come on, please, please, please. Oh, uh, <laughs> there's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles. That was obviously fake. Well, GE, it's pretty difficult to tell from all the way up here, but if that one's fake, then that one has to be the right one. So let's go. And look at that. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Why am I taking damage, though? Oh my, nah. There's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles. That was fake water. Fake water? Well, now I'm literally out of options, GE. There's lava and there's blue wool. Yeah, so which one are you gonna pick? Hmm, well, actually, GE, if that was fake water, then this might be fake lava. Hmm, you might be onto something, Bubbles. What if you try jumping in? Let's test if it's real or not. Come on, please. And wait, I just made it through. Good job, Bubbles. You actually made it through. But now you're gonna have to make a really important decision. Are you gonna choose the blue treasure or the green treasure? Uh, well, is that even a question, GE? Because blue is definitely the best color in the entire world. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, Bubbles. But I guess you could open that up. Yeah, I will. And you're not gonna do anything about it. And, uh, what the heck? Haha, <laughs> there's no way you just fell for that bubbles and 
wait a second. Are you serious right now? Yeah, G, that's literally what you get for blowing me up. Now your entire build's on fire. Oh, nah, well, you chose the wrong treasure bubbles, and now my entire build's exploded. Oh, no, I kind of feel bad, G. How about I make it up to you by picking the green treasure? Yeah, I guess you could, and don't worry, I'll put it all out later. Sounds good, G. Well, let me just open up this green chest real quick. And what in the world? There's so many diamonds, blue crystals, and rotten flesh. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Wait a second, why are you actually eating it? Get out of here. Ah! Well, now that I've checked out your build, do you want to check out mine? Of course, Bubbles. Let's go. Whee! When can I turn around? You can turn around in three, two, one. Turn around. All right, so let me see. And oh my god, this build is massive. How in the world did you build this? What can I say, GE? I'm just a building professional. I don't know if a professional could build this in 10 minutes. That's like not enough time. It's plenty enough time. I just had to build super duper fast. All right, whatever you say, Bubbles, but this build's literally massive. How in the world do I even get inside this thing? I'll give you a little hint, GE. It's your favorite color. My favorite color is so green. And hold up. Wait a minute. I already see it. Let's go. Yep, I made it super obvious for you. But now we can just go inside and welcome to the first official obstacle and whoa what the what is this this is a lava tightrope you're gonna have to get across this super thin tightrope without falling off without falling off <laughs> that's a piece of cake i'm gonna just start running over here and then run just like this come on come on come on and i'm almost at the end let's go what the heck how did you get through that so quick relax you know me bubbles i'm the best tightroper in the entire world ah okay fine g i guess you could collect your prize let's go i'm gonna open this up real quick and, and wait, what? You just got eaten by a cyclops. Are you serious, right, Neo Bubbles? What even is that? What do you mean, GE? Have you never seen a cyclops before? Uh, no. He's like super massive and he doesn't have a shirt on. That's like really disgusting. I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> well, you have to get out anyways because this was the fake entrance. If that wasn't obvious enough already. But fine, let me just take a look. Maybe it's inside of his camera head and no. Nope. Or maybe it's inside of his massive wing and ugh. Not even close, brother. Are are you serious, Arneo Bubbles? Where in the world is this entrance? This build is, like, way too big. Why are you asking me, GE? I'm not gonna tell you. You're not gonna tell me? Are you sure about that? Oh, uh, uh, wait, 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 GE. What in the world is that? Put that away. Ah! Okay, fine, G. I'll tell you where it is. Just follow me. Come on. Let's go. And I don't know why you didn't look here in the first place, but it's right inside of his super cool core. Oh, yeah. That would be a good spot to find it, but I guess I didn't. So let me just walk inside and wait a second. What the heck is this, Bubbles? Well, GE, have you ever played Geometry Dash before? Uh, Geometry Dash? What the heck is a geometry? Oh, my. Never mind, GE. You're just gonna have to jump over all of these springs and not get hit by the spikes. Well, good for me, Bubbles, because I'm a master geometry here. Yeah, I guess. Whatever that that means let's go let me just make this jump real quick and are you serious right now um why did you fall already ge i don't know bubbles but at least i didn't die so let me just make a second try over here let me just make this jump <laughs> I'm telling you, GE, this is super duper hard. That was not funny, Bubbles. You are not the Rizzler, but good thing third time's the charm. So let me just make this jump over here and then jump over this spring just like this. No way you're making it through. And oh no, this jump's gonna be really scary, but good for me because I'm a parkour pro. Yeah. What the heck? You just skipped over those two. But I guess you made it through, GE. Let's go. So let me just open up this door and... Oh, no. What is that? That right there is a mutant phantom, and you're gonna have to fight it. I'm gonna have to fight it? Gulp. But I literally just have this dirt. You're so silly, GE. There's literally a chest right in front of you. Oh, yeah. I guess you are right. So let me just open it up and... Really, dude? There's literally a password. Because <laughs> I wouldn't make it that easy for you. Oh, my. So how in the world do I get the code to this thing? Well, let me just tell you this, GE. There's two buttons on the wall over here, and one of them is gonna give you the password, and one of them might do something a little bit different might do something different that sounds a bit scary but oh there's a green button right over here i'm definitely gonna press it <laughs> dude there's no way you just fell for that really bubbles that was not funny yeah well i have no idea why you would pick the green one i obviously love blue well actually green is supposed to be the most scientifically best color in the entire world this guy thinks he's smart when he actually chose the wrong button all right all right whatever you say bubbles you're literally yapping right now so let me just press this blue button right here and Whoa, this paper literally says 5555. Five, five, five. So let me open it up and whoa, there's a bunch of silver armor, the silver sword, and a golden apple. Yep, you're looking super duper cool, GE. Check me out, mutant phantom. I'm way too dripped out for you. Come on, bubbles, drop the walls. All right, whatever you say, GE, the walls are dropping in three, 
two, one, go! You got nothing on me and... Oh, no. Oh, no. He's actually doing a bit of damage. And look at that. You already died. It's okay, Bull. Second time's the charm. Let me just get a few hits like this. Can you get him? Can you get him? Come on. And really, dude. He's literally dropping bombs on you, GE. Come on. Just one more hit. And there we go. Wait, no way. You actually killed him. Yep. And he even dropped this really cool egg, too. Whoa, that's super duper cool. Yeah, but I'm still taking a lot of damage. So we need to get out of here. Go, go, go. And GE looks like you made it to my skibbity toilet parkour room. And whoa, there's a bunch of skibbity toilets down there. You think they're trying to riz me up? Uh, I don't think so, GE. I think they're literally trying to destroy you. Yeah, that is a good point, but I still have more skibbity riz than you, Bubbles. What the? Well, let's see if you can make it through this parkour. All right, so let me just make this jump right over here. Come on. And wait, why are you breezing through this right now? Because I'm a parkour pro. You already know me, Bubbles. But wait, there's an ender pearl inside of this chest. Yep, with the ender pearl, you're gonna have to choose if you want to teleport to this platform or this platform. Well, hmm, let me think about this real quick. If left is left and right is right, then that means you couldn't make it the right one because the right one would have to be right. So I'm gonna choose the left one. Let's go! And look at that, you just fell through! Skibbity, no, no, no! No way, G, you just got eaten by the skibbity toilets! Yeah, I guess I'm not the Rizzler, but wait a second. I still have an ender pearl left over. What if I just throw it all the way across over here? Wait, what? You're not supposed to do that! <laughs> But I just did. Let's go. Oh my god. Well, gee, if you think you're so smart, then can you get past this one? Hmm, let's see how hard this is. Get pooped on. Ew, that doesn't really sound good. Or get your prize. It could be a ton of emeralds. I'm gonna go down. Let's go. Oh yeah. And wait a second. Why is a bunch of turrets shooting at me? Ow, ow, ow. Haha, <laughs> get them turrets. Oh my nah. There's no way, G. You just got completely destroyed by my high power turrets. Yeah, I guess I did. But you know what's even worse? I might have to go down this one now. Wait, so you're saying that you want to get pooped on? Uh, uh no, no. Uh, that's kind of weird, G. Hey, yo, no, 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 Bubbles, you're, you're super sus for that. You know what? I actually have an idea. Let me just break this sign right over here. Uh, G, what are you doing? And then I'm gonna place another sign over here, and then we're gonna put, get the Grimace Shake. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, my, you're not supposed to do that, but I guess the Grimace Shake is pretty cool, so let's just go down. Let's go, and, ooh, there's a door over over here. Yep, and you can open it to see where it leads you. All right, come on. And wait a second. What is this? You just made it to the jetpack course, GE. You're gonna have to take this jetpack and fly it through all of these laser rings. Fly it through all these rings? That would be really hard if I wasn't a jetpack pro. Let's go. This is gonna be a piece of cake. Well, you gotta be careful, GE, because those rings can hurt you. Yeah, and I already just got past two of them, and ow! What the? How are you literally at the last one already? I don't know, Bubbles. I'm literally just a professional, and wait a second. What's happening to me? Uh, uh, what do you mean, GE? Uh -oh. ah, what the heck is happening? Is your jetpack malfunctioning? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Ow. Brother, what in the world just happened? I have no idea. My jetpack was making super weird noises. Yeah, and it kind of sounded like you. Uh, no, it didn't, Bubbles. I have no idea what you're talking about. But anyways, let me just make it through like this. And there we go. Ah, I should have made that course more difficult, but I guess you made it to the end. For the last and final decision, you're gonna have to pick between the diamond treasure or the emerald treasure. The diamond treasure or the emerald treasure? Well, let me spell this side real quick. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna choose this trust. Uh, okay, look behind you. Ah! <laughs> yeah, gee, I don't know how you haven't learned. I would never make the emerald one the right one. Okay, what the freak, Bubbles? That was not funny. I mean, I'd say seeing you go flying was super duper funny. Yeah, yeah, okay. You're literally yapping again, Bubbles. So let me just open up this chest right over here. And whoa, there's a bunch of emeralds and poisonous potatoes. It's all for you. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, G, now that we checked out each other's builds, whose do you think was better? Hmm, we'll look carefully at both of our builds. I think that mine is better. Wait, what? Literally look at them. Mine is way better. What are you talking about, Bubbles? My build was fire. Literally. Ha, <laughs> yeah, I get it. Because your build caught on fire. Oh my nah, but we still have to decide who the winner is. So how in the world are we gonna do that? Hmm, that is a good question. I guess we'll let the comments decide. Alright, everyone comment GE! What the? No, everyone comment Bubbles! Ah! And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And if you want to see another one of our adventures, then click the video on screen. Go click it, click it, click it. Bye. Bye. I need the max win.